One. Hello and welcome to Physics with Mr. Bedwell. Today we're going to do the Physics Practical Density. For AQA Physics it's Practical 5. For AQA Combined Science it's Practical 17. And this is what we need. We need a balance. Our objects, we have a regular shape, irregular shape, and our liquid sample. A ruler, measuring cylinders, and a eureka can. So for a regular shape, we measure the mass using the balance. And colors. And we measure the length width and height using a ruler as you would any other way. Once we have our width, depth and height, we can time them together to get to the volume. And here is one we did earlier. As you can see, when we multiply our length, width and height together, we get our volume, in this case 64 centimetres cubed. We also have our mass from our balance. If we divide the mass by the volume, it will give us the density. In this case, 0.55 grams per centimetre cubed. For any regular shape, such as this rock, we would use a Eureka can. So for the first method for irregular shape, we displace water from a Eureka can into a measuring cylinder by gently lowering your object into the Eureka can. and collecting the displaced volume of water, like so. If you don't have a Eureka can, you can place an object into a measuring cylinder with some water already in it. In here, we have 100 centimetres cubed of water. If we gently lower our object into it, the new volume, so minus the old volume, will give us the volume of the object. So when we measure, using measuring cylinders, we need to make sure we measure from the bottom of the meniscus, not the top. For our liquid samples, we have to work out the mass. We take our measuring cylinder, and we zero down onto our balance to negate the mass of that measuring cylinder. We can add our volume of water. And again, we do mass divided by volume to give us the density. 